San Diego Gulls are hosting Fan Appreciation Night on Saturday. Joining me to talk more about that and what you can expect is the voice of the team and a regular here on KUSI. Everybody, put your hands together for Andy Silch. <laughs> Andy, welcome back and hey, thank, thank you. you. It's winding down. This yes. year did not go the way you had hoped, nope, but nope. I mean, we've had some great years and now we have. At your level, things kind of are secular, are they not? Yeah, and, and you know what, too? It's it's going to be an uptick. You know, we're, we're seeing some young kids coming right now out of college, out of junior hockey, and we're going to see a good flow of them during the off season. We're actually really excited for years beyond, and this upcoming draft for the Anaheim Ducks is going to be very impactful for us for years to come as well. All right, so now we're winding down. You have how yep. many left on the uh, docket? We have two home and two on the road, and those two at home are this weekend. All right, and that's why you're here. That's correct. You want to say thank you for the people that have supported you. Right. I bet you the appreciation is even more during the tougher times, and it's easy to support yes. a winning team, right? Yeah, it really is. Uh, this is actually it's a good point because uh, this is one that we're <laughs> – well, you know, I've talked to you about this uh, in times past about how we're we're blowing the doors off of a, a theme night. Well, tonight, or sorry, tomorrow and even Saturday, it's kind of a dual effort here. We're going to have a lot given away during the course of our hockey games, Friday and Saturday at seven o'clock at Pechanga Arena. All right, well, let's talk about it. Yeah. I mean, don't don't bury the lead. Well, I, what's, I, I'll let you pick. Which day do you want to start on first, Friday let's or start, Saturday? Let's go in or let's go in sequential order. Friday, please. So Friday, our third jersey, the the. Pacific Ocean blue jersey with the old school Willie O'Ree Gulls logo across it. Those are going to be auctioned off to fans. So you have an opportunity to get those off of the players' backs. Outside Section 10, we do have a link that's uh, through our website that you can get it if you can't go to the game, which, oh man, if you can't go to the game, well, you're missing out. But we also have our $5 Gulls Blue Line Blonde Ale on Friday night. So it's going to be a really fun atmosphere. This uh, we're week. expecting the turn tiles to spin a little bit, right? Oh, they're going to be turning good. <laughs> All right. And then Saturday? Yep. So Saturday, we have a lot. This is our full fan appreciation night. So it starts with our tip tailgate from 5 to 7. Uh, we'll have music, we'll have drink specials, we'll have food, we'll have games and activities for children. It's free to anybody. It's in our parking lot of our arena, so that kind of kickstarts the night. And now I'll actually move into when you enter the doors, you will get a Lukash Dostal goalie goal bobblehead. So I'm going to have some thrilling TV here. I'm going to open this up. I actually oh. have not seen this oh, live Oh, well, you yet. have to see it. it but was... the, the reason why we're, we're celebrating this, last year in March, our blue chip prospect, he's actually up in Anaheim right now, he scored a goal as a goalie. There is an empty net Which on the other side of the ice, and it's so rare. It rarely happens. So we decided over the off season that we're going to celebrate it. And for fans entering the doors, the first 7,000, We'll get this goalie goal bobblehead. This is him celebrating after he scored that goal with the stick too. And, and yep. how what are when players get a? That's a, that's like one of the moments of hey, I've arrived when they get their own bobblehead, right? Oh, it's it's incredible. It's a big deal for the athletes as well, is it not? It, it is, and we actually we had a, a reaction video on our Instagram when we unveiled this <laughs> to him, and uh, it was it was pretty comical because he's not a man of many words, <laughs> but but he was kind of left speechless when he saw it. He was pretty impressed with it. Oh, very cool. So that's not going to be it though. So during the game, we're going to have several uh, different giveaways that include stagecoach tickets, concert tickets, Ducks memorabilia, Gulls memorabilia. I mean, you can get Trevor Zegras signed stuff. Like it's it's going to be a very cool event. It's going to be an entertainment game aside from the game itself. So keep your eyes and ears open during the course of the hockey game. The season, for those who don't follow it closely, is a grind. Yes. But, but it, as much for the people off the ice as on the ice, as I'm sure you can attest. Do you get a moment to decompress before you get right back into it? How does it work for you? Yeah, yeah, we'll have, uh, for an off season, you know, it, it kind of, it, it's not as a full grind, obviously, when you play a 72-game schedule and the travel out here in the Western Conference, it's pretty tough. Yeah. But, uh, you know, I, I don't want to say that we're going to throw it into, uh, you know, a steady gear. We're going to have different things during the course of the off season that are going to keep our fans engaged through social media. We're going to have fun uh, giveaways, different Different things that we're going to do interacting and player signings you know once we hit June and July it's all we're about gonna, that, it's right? right back in it again development camp for our rookies which we opened the conversation talking about that you know hopefully this is going to be a season that we're going to put in the rearview mirror and we're going to have high hopes moving into next year well they're all 
to appreciate the highs, you must have a couple lows. Yep. I mean, isn't that how it works in sports and, and, and in the, life in general? That's true. And, and the true fans really came out this year, game in and game out, win or lose, whether it was a six to one loss or a six to one win. They were with us. That's why we've coined the nickname America's Finest Fans. All right. Yeah. And uh, I hope you get some rest. Uh, I assume you're going to be back, right? I'll be back. Oh, yeah. All right. Yeah. So uh, thank you very much for coming in. We hope that the fans turn out big on Friday and big on Saturday yes. and say goodbye. And then not goodbye. So long. So long. Now. Correct. So, so long for yeah. now.